There can't really be a place where people go into big buildings and give away all their money just to watch someone flip paper squares on a table. So we are back on our way to the dead horses settlement camp village town whatever I don't even know what to expect here and there seems to be someone hostile nearby but here we are oh Joshua's just ahead there in the angel cave okay Whoa, bath time. I'm gonna check out this branch. I think this is the head. Yeah, this is uh, taking us back to the cave. Everybody's asleep. I wonder if they have a spare spare coat. I can see you, dude. I'm just... I'm just minding my own business first and then, then I'm gonna check out your stuff. Carry all those bottle caps anyway. Friendly tribes the shave like their crazy. heads, but uh, the hostile white legs uh, have this sort of dreadlock uh, hairdo going on. So that would be useful for if, if, uh, if I got uh, in the distance. Auslander Zuka Joshua Graham. You know our tongue. Smart. No, Auslander. I don't. Joshua in high place of cave. You show respect, Utman. Joshua is greatest warrior. You show him no respect. He show you thunder and fire. Utman, huh? So there is some some sort of uh, other European linguistic uh, influence here. You wise for Auslander. Ah, so before I suspected that uh, Chok had some uh, some German sounds to him. And so do they, huh? Disciple. Okay, but where's the dude who waved this in? Right, the first disciple. He had a unique name.
We should have given you a better welcome on your first visit to Zion. But from what I hear, the White Legs beat us to it. White Legs seem to be the only visitors we have these days. And I wouldn't have expected anyone from the Mojave to come looking for us. And you're a courier, no less. Not the one I was expecting. Mm. But I suppose he wouldn't have come with a caravan. I don't know if you were close to the other members of your group. But you have my sympathy. I pray for the safety of all good people who come to Zion. Even Gentiles. But we can't expect God to do all the work. Huh, so I will be gathering... I will be finding out something about the curi courier business over here as well. Interesting. The dead horses are capable scouts. Nothing passes into or out of Zion without my hearing of it. Happy trails. I remember. They were good friends. I have bad news for your employers. New Canaan was destroyed, its citizens scattered. All because of the White Legs. And Caesar, of course. The White Legs want to join the Legion. Caesar's rite of passage is the destruction of the New Canaanites. Almost assuredly because of me. The good news is that we can help you find your way back. Daniel, one of the other new Canaanites, has made many maps of the region. I see. The bad news is that we can't help you right now. Not with everything that's going on. I wonder if anything that he, he has to uh, say to me will help me to convince the uh, great cons to drop the Legion Alliance. You're a good neighbor to us. We all go through periods of darkness. In such times, we can turn to the Lord. But it's good to have friends. Daniel and I need pre-war tools to help us navigate beyond Zion. Should we need to evacuate, these instruments will be vital to us. Normally, we would have some of the dead horses or sorrows look for them. But many pre-war buildings in the valley are taboo. They won't go inside. The Sorrows believe in a spirit that lives in the caves. Say the spirit punished them once for trespassing. Ah, okay. They now put I special get it. marks around the cave entrances to keep people out. It doesn't work on the white legs, of course. But the dead horses are spooked. So the Sorrows are the descendants of Fall 22. Okay. Thank you. Follows Chalk can help you find your way around the valley. He's inexperienced, but he knows enough of our language to ignore the taboos about pre-war <laughs> buildings. Okay, I'm gonna make a manual save over here. Once I get all my quests. Any more? Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Are we gonna go on a picnic? some actual scouting, not just following. Okay, so all the tools I need over here. I'm gonna check one thing. I, uh, I noticed that from each of the survival caves I would get three uh, journal entries. 
that's one cave. Two, uh, I mean four, five, six, that's two caves. Seven, eight, nine, three caves. Ten, eleven, twelve, four caves. Okay, oh, there weren't uh, three everywhere. Okay, it seems like I have. I have only been to five caves, so there's one more somewhere. Where does this lead to? Outside. Wait, wait, but I, I wanna. I wanna talk to you. I wanna find out more. Welcome back. What can I do for you? Oh yeah. Caesar would never admit this openly, but he knows that I'm alive. I've killed enough of his frumentari and assassins that have come looking. I've heard one of them travels the Mojave as a courier. <gasps> Most of Caesar's agents meet a fitting end in NCR territory, but maybe this one survived. So, the business with the other courier and the legion converge. That's interesting. So, meaning uh, I don't just have to figure out that the legion are well, bad guys, but they are also my bad guys now. A great deal. There are three, make that four, tribes here in Zion. You've already met the White Legs on the way in. In this camp, you'll find dead horses. In the Narrows, the Sorrows. And finally, there's Daniel and myself. Mm. We're new Canaanites. They attack everyone who isn't a white leg, especially caravans. They don't know how to survive on their own, so they have to raid. But as for why they are here, they are trying to wipe us out. All of us. They want to join Caesar's legion. And they can only prove their worth by destroying the new Canaanites and everyone we shelter. Most don't. It's been hundreds of years since the war. They've developed their own languages. Take the dead horses. We think they were originally refugees from a place called Rez, hmm. east of the Grand Canyon. They speak a combination of Rez and a language spoken by travelers who were visiting Rez when the bombs fell. Over time, two languages blended. I was a translator years ago, but it's hard to keep up with all of the tribal variations. I bet they had some German tourists over there. The valley belongs to God, but no. The dead horses live at Dead Horse Point, up the Colorado River. They came here because I asked them to. Before I returned to the fold, I visited them years earlier. I looked much different then, but I left an impression on them. I taught them how to hunt more efficiently, how to maintain their weapons and pre-war equipment. When I returned, they showed their appreciation. The Sorrows have many skilled hunters among them, but no warriors. They have not had to deal with war or raiders for decades. Even though they can hunt a full-grown Yaogwai, they don't know how to deal with the White Lakes. Huh. That's why we're here. Okay. We wear more clothing than them and understand more about technology. But we're still a tribe, a linked family of families. The Boneyard, Phoenix, New Vegas, they're just places metal and stone. New Canaan dies, but the tribe lives on. When the walls come tumbling down, when you lose everything you have, you always have family. And your family always has tribe. How come the... Uh, this pile isn't getting any smaller, although he keeps taking the guns from there? <laughs> okay. Of see. course. I don't want to be disrespectful, but I, I want to know stuff. Uh, okay, 
save in God case I you. piss him out. Welcome back. What can I do for you? Because as... As a... a convinced heathen myself, I... I feel a bit spooked out. I am a new Canaanite. We believe we are the heirs of a spiritual tradition given to our ancestors thousands of years ago. We have made and kept covenants with our Lord God to honor his laws. In exchange, we are promised eternal salvation after this life. A day will come when our Lord returns to judge us all. Until then, we must honor his laws and start others along the path of salvation if we can. That's why we trade with others and work the tribes. We have more than food and medicine to offer. Good news is our most valuable commodity. Whether there is a god or not, his existence doesn't depend on what you believe or what I say. There is much to be skeptical of in this world, so it no longer surprises me to learn how many people don't really believe in anything. But I believe that our Lord was made flesh as Jesus Christ and died to redeem me. And you. And the sorrows. Even the white legs. Everyone. I wouldn't say that. I am the acting war chief for the dead horses. They look up to me for such matters. But I only have the authority they give me. Daniel is the spiritual leader and main link of the new Canaanites to the Sorrows. He's up in the Narrows right now. In the Great Basin and Colorado Plateau, all tribes are known for a specific weapon. Oh, that's good. White Legs are known for their big submachine guns, storm drums. They broke into an armory near Spanish Fork and have been using them for years. Of course, the dead horses have their wooden war clubs. And even the Sorrows have their Yao Guai gauntlets. This type of 45 automatic pistol was designed by one of my tribe almost 400 years hmm. ago. Learning its use is a new Canaanite rite of passage. Right now, I'd like you to focus on helping Daniel. Maybe there will be time later. We do. Though the White Legs destroyed New Canaan, they didn't destroy all of our supply caches. All forms of currency are recognized here. Caps, NCR dollars, mm -hmm. even Legion coin. Take a look. Okay, let's see then. What I do not need. They pay pretty good for cave fungus. Hmm. And why does cave fungus have this food icon on it? It's odd. Anyway. Oh, and they pay well for that too, right? As well. Okay. I mean, the concussion. So. I, if I do pick up more fungi, it's uh, good for trading. That's good to know. I wonder if he and Elijah have some dealings together. If not uh, directly, then... I always end up with uh, two 
regular microfusion cells when I when I do the optimizing thing. It's old. Let's see where I need to drop. Oh, actually, yeah, I will I will sell my plant stuff because then I can pick some more outside. Win-win. just in case oh, I don't need the pulse uh, weapons right now shooting for a while. And also, what I noticed is that tobacco doesn't grow here. I suppose again it's, uh, it's too much rainfall for it.
Let me have a look. My tribe may take too much pride in its mechanical talents, but in truth, we are intrigued by the workings <laughs> of a fine firearm. I was more thinking... Oh, okay, he doesn't do that. Or, in other words, he does, but it's uh, too damn expensive. God be with you. Okay then. So, as far as the main quest goes, I think uh, the next. Uh, move is to go to Daniel. As far as my actual path goes, I'm not sure what to do right now. Should take a nap here. I wonder if they if they will teach me uh, some fighting tricks later on. So it's a club that has some uh, bullets put Those, into it. Um, I understand. What did you call them? Walkie takies. Those are going to be loads better than signal drums and smoke signs. <laughs> oh yeah, now I get it. Let's see, it's uh, wood and uh, wooden bullets. Okay. Let's talk. Yo. Oh. <laughs> Good. Good. Yawol. Huh? Wait, touch this. No, 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 no. Stand still. September. Oh, it's all the months. Are heading out there to get the talkie walkies and stuff and I think it's a good place to to pause and regroup again so see you later bye bye